lots of arguments and lofty opinions that set them up, set themselves up against the true knowledge of God. In Luke 16, 16, it says, up until now the law and the prophets and then of coming now the kingdom. So it also tells us false gospels and false prophets and false Christs, even if an angel brings them, which I could insert Jabril in an eisegesis kind of way, they are, they are to be cursed by God. So that's why I, it's nothing personal. Like I've got Muslim no, friends and that. I just don't want people going to hell. On the if if the injil is revealed by Allah, if the Torah and the Psalms are His, then and in the Quran, even though it's abrogated, it says that Jews and Christians will go to heaven. Allah says Jew, uh, Christians will be made superior until the day of judgment. Therefore, if the Bible's corrupted, there are no Christians, true Christians. That makes Allah a liar. So either the book's still fine. Do you see what, like there's too many little... Give me, give me, give me a second. Um, Go for it. First and foremost, um, if we just leave the Arabic words out and just translate Please. them to English because... I've got an Arabic speaker. Because it creates a bit of confusion, you see. Yeah. Um, I personally... Okay, so first and foremost, if we deal with one point at a time, so let's say in terms of no, false, let's get the back of your thing. Yeah, in, yeah, so let's say in terms of false scriptures, yes, how do you determine a false, false gospel? Okay, so the Bible in its entirety, leaving aside the question of the apocrypha, as in revelation, is the revelation of Jesus Christ, who is God in the Bible, come to earth. Therefore, his is, his is the last and final say so. It's a, an event that hasn't happened yet. So, anything out extra biblical, anything outside of the Bible can claim to be inspired. It can say that it's truth, but it can't claim to be in the line of prophets that God has ordained. Because Luke says that it has been said that up until Christ are the law and the prophets, both are not abolished, but they're negated by the presence of God on earth. No one can add to the words of this book. No one can or take away. That's that's also cursed in the end of Revelation. So any new gospel, any new good news, a way to Allah or Yahweh that is superseding, that is saying it alone has authority now. It is the new and last and best revelation. Cannot be a continuation of the true scripture in my okay, opinion. My when, true scripture. When, when you say when you say biblical, yes. Um, are you referring to as as stated by Jesus or other people? Uh, both. So Jesus is quoted and directly speaks within the Bible. He is he himself refers to Adam. He referred like he is prophesied by Isaiah. Like the, it, it's, the Bible says we we work precept upon precept, line upon line, here a little, there a little. So the whole Bible, it says all scripture, but it restricts itself to within the Bible, is God's And therefore, the words of Christ, in effect, are equal to the, the prophets, sorry, are equal to Christ in that they are God-breathed. With respect, the question I'm asking is very specific. Go for it. Did Jesus himself say that this good news Bible. Okay. Is, is the last good news there ever, there ever will be. Would, Jesus himself. I would have to check what, who is speaking in Luke. Um, he, yeah, Luke states, and it's God breathed, but no, Christ says, this is my revelation to John on Patmos from God the Father um, concerning the end times. It goes on about, so that is the last word because we go from Genesis to Revelation. We have the beginning of days to the end of days. There is no room for Allah or any other God to come along and say, I am Yahweh and I've changed my mind about divorce. I've changed my mind about the amount of uh, wives you can have. I've changed my mind about fighting. Now I'm saying, oh believers, it is prescribed for you to fight and you will fight. If With you respect, like it. your answer is things I haven't asked. Christ affirmed the Torah. He taught the Torah. Therefore, it's his words. He revealed the Torah. He is the creator of all things. He's the author and finisher of the faith, my faith, Christianity. So, he, in that he, ha, he himself has the last word in the Bible and he quotes the first word. He, he knew in his time, what was the extant was the Torah, the Psalms, all of the Old Testament was there, Job, all of that was done. 
So he came as a man, he didn't have access to a New Testament, obviously. He just had the Old Testament, which he affirmed 100%. He quoted it, he taught it, he was there preaching that stuff. He so was, he preached the Torah? Yes. So yes. did he bring anything new? Yes. He, he gave, preached the Torah and he brought something. Yes, because he is the God who revealed the Torah. I'm not, I'm not no, questioning No, 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 that's what I'm saying. So that's I'm, why he's justified him doing so. I'm not questioning yeah. what I'm Okay, so yes, he did. And then, and then, the eyewitnesses of his teachings in order to be able to make disciples of all nations, which is what Christ calls us to do, wrote down his doings and sayings, a bit like a sunnah and a whatever. They wrote them down. They were attested to by other men, other eyewitnesses. I know, but I'm, I see, I'm trying to figure out what Jesus said. I'm Christ not concerned says, okay, about other people. Just Jesus specifically. Yes, Jesus confirmed. As he said that yes. there cannot be any other scripture. Yeah, let me it. check the verse. Meanwhile, Christ refers to Adam, the first man. He himself is the second Adam. He's referred to as the second Adam. Sin enters the world by one man, and it is redeemed by one man who is God. Right, so where's Luke? I'm so happy speakers for this. So happy. Right, so Christ, Christ himself says, the law and the prophets were proclaimed until John. Since that time, the gospel of the kingdom of God is being preached and everyone is forcing his way into it. And then he says, but it is easier for heaven and earth to pass away than for a single stroke of a pen to drop out of the law. And then he goes on to talk about divorce and other uh, tour, like uh, mosaic law. So yes, he himself says there will be no more prophets that no more law. Yes, he says. No, yes, no more law is one thing. No more prophets. Law and one. the prophets. Up until this time. Up until the time of John. Where am I? Oh, it's gone off a bit, sorry. Right, so he says. The law and the prophets were, past tense, proclaimed until John. That's the end of the proclamations. No more prophets, no more law is being proclaimed. But didn't prophets come after John? Didn't Jesus come after John? John, uh, Jesus isn't a prophet. He didn't come after John. No, okay. no, he didn't actually. He was six months younger than John. He was their cousins. So Jesus is six months younger than John. Yes, Elizabeth was visited by the Holy. Uh, her husband, the Holy Spirit, had a hand in their union. John, John the Baptist. Right? Yes. Yeah. So the law and the prophets were proclaimed until John, because John himself says, "I am one crying in the wilderness. I am telling you of the one to come whose, whose sandals I can't even." like do you know what I mean so he's proclaiming the Lord he says make straight the path he's referring to I think Isaiah who speaks about making the path straight for God but John says make straight the path for one who is coming he keeps saying right, he is coming but back, back to the verse um, the law and the prophets were proclaimed until John since that time so from then onwards the gospel of the kingdom of God is being preached how can it be being preached if the New Testament hasn't been written yet these are his words at that time. He says, up until John, which is like contemporary law and prophets, at this time right now, it's the king, the gospel of the kingdom, the good news, and Christ is the gospel. Oh, no, no. Is that what it says? Yes. What does it since, say? Since, right. The law, the law and the prophets were proclaimed until John since that, since that time. The gospel of the kingdom of God is being preached okay, so right now. Okay, what is that saying about the no, I'm saying there was no book called the New Testament at that time. The New Testament is the recording of the gospel of the kingdom being preached. It's all the writings of who said what and when they I said know, it. I know, but this seems to be advocating for the Torah. Yes. Yeah, the Torah is not abrogated. Okay, for who, Christians. who's claimed that the Torah is abrogated? You're saying it seems to vouch for it. Why wouldn't it vouch for it? No, I'm, I'm not. Oh, I'm not sorry. I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yes, it does, yeah. Okay. Christ talks about the law, but he says the two greatest commandments. But wait, wait, wait. If we just yeah. focus on yes. this particular verse. Yep. Um, but okay. it's easier for heaven and earth to pass away if than I for mean. a single stroke. Uh, okay. No problem. Of a pen if, to drop out the law. No problem. Okay. Um, so one, we agree that that's advocating for the Torah. That's Christ. And you ask me, does Christ say that there will be no new book? I know. Can we just do yeah. this Yes, question? yes, yes, yes. Does this verse advocate for the Torah? Yeah, it doesn't denigrate it in any way. No. But, but, but. It does the opposite. But. It no, it doesn't. But it says it is until now. Fine. I don't so have... it's finished now. It's done. I don't have, a, I don't have an issue yeah. with that. So it's not advocating it for now. It's not saying, and now you'll carry on with the Torah. 
but do this new stuff. It's not saying follow the law because in the New Testament it says, for no man by any means will be justified by works of the law. So, you, so the New Testament um, let me, let me contradicts clarify. what you just read? No, let me clarify. After Christ is crucified and resurrected, there is no need to perform the law. You will want to keep Why? the law does because the verse of the Holy say Spirit. That though? Yes. Well, if you read it again, the verse, oh, the right verse doesn't need to say that. I know the Bible. No, I'm but, just telling you no, other stuff that verifies. No, but what I'm trying to say to you is this verse is either relevant or it's not. That it's relevant to your question of does Jesus himself say that there will be no other new stuff coming? He does say that. The law and the prophets were proclaimed until John. Since that time, from then till now, uh -huh. the gospel of the kingdom is being, current event, is being preached. So the gospel and of the kingdom is And everyone is Torah? forcing his way. No, the gospel of the kingdom of God is Christ. But is that what the law verse and is? the prophets. The law and the prophets is the Torah. Okay. And then the kingdom from Christ, he is the kingdom. He well, is salvation. Well, how did you get that from that verse? I didn't get it only from that verse. I got it from studying the Bible. Okay, but, but I'm that's my what what you The just law wrote. and the prophets. The Torah, the old way, is proclaimed until John. Yeah? That's it. It's done with now. No, no, don't tell me that's done with. Just read the verse. Until John. Not after John. Just read the verse. I just did. I the law you're, you're and the prophets. Area. No, I'm not. The law and the prophets were proclaimed until John. Uh -huh. Since that time, so it's not happening anymore. What? The gospel of the kingdom of God is being preached. So where did you get not happening anymore from? What because you just it's read? since that time. So what? Since that until, time, it's being preached. Until yeah, until then it so was being preached. Read? Because until means up into a fixed point. Do you know what you do? Yeah. Read the verse without stopping. The law and the prophets were proclaimed until John. Since that time, the gospel of the kingdom of God is being preached. So where did you get that it stopped? Are because you the word the Torah, until the in English, no, it's not. So, so the Torah it is, is not, not the, the gospel, no. But was the Torah not from God? It's not the gospel. No, no, I'm not asking about the gospel. You just did. Was the Torah not from God? Yes. So how is the Torah not the kingdom of God? It's not the kingdom of God. The kingdom, how did you come to that conclusion? Because the kingdom of God references Christ and so does the gospel. Please answer my question. I just did. No, you're giving me a narrative. You said, where did I get it from? No, I you, get it from reading, but I have to explain no, to you my mental this, process. From this verse, yes? there is nothing to indicate that it the wasn't. Torah is yes, not the kingdom, is. Of, okay. kingdom of God. Okay. Yes, there is. And you could say listen, that listen, the word listen. of God watch, is watch, not watch. the I'll kingdom of God. I'll do it straight from the verse. Since that time. So therefore, this isn't happening anymore. Since that go. time. Because it's so obvious to me. So since, if I do something. Since that time, the gospel. The gospel wasn't there before. Since that, that, that time. No, we can't, since that can't time. It didn't see. happen prior to that time. Since that time. You got, it's been happening. You can't force a narrative on me, like I'm not forcing it on you. you. You're not, not a Christian. You, you don't have to no, buy it. No, no, it's not about being a. It's not about being, having any any particular label. It's just pure, simple literacy. As nothing a from what you read, something nothing other from than the what Bible. you read indicates that it has stopped. What do you say? What do you nothing. Say, what do you say about the word and until? Nothing from what, what you have read. Give me a moment, please. Until. Give me a moment. Yeah. It depends oh, on the context. Yeah, in the context that you have put it in, you don't want if, context. I, no, you the want context, the verse. No, the verse is that verse. There's nothing. I can read the prayer. There is nothing from that perfect. verse that indicates that a it has stopped or b that it is not, that the Torah is not the kingdom the of words, God until or c and since or c then. or c. Nor could you say. That the word of God, the Torah, is not the kingdom of God. I can, that's, that's, I can that's say it's earth. not. The, it says the gospel of the kingdom. So of you're God. saying the Torah is not the gospel? Yes. And How so is the Torah will every single Christian. What does the gospel mean? The good news. So is the Torah not the good it news? It was for Israel. No, but see, it's you're, not you're, for you're Gentiles. One I'm not forcing a another. narrative. It's biblical. Yes, linguistically speaking. Biblically. Okay, I'm asking you. Linguistically speaking, yeah. is the Torah a gospel? No. So it's not a good news. It's not a gospel. It, does, what does gospel mean? Does it not mean good, good news? news? Yes. So is the Torah good news? For the Israelites, yes. Thank you, that's all I asked you. Okay, but not, but not, why for, force not like John 3, 16, over a not, for question. The, not for you and not for See, me. For me, well, not I'm for me you either. Question. But do you understand? It's a specific race no, of No, but do you understand the difference between communicating in terms yes. of language You're trying and to communicating? Give speech. me a moment. No, I'm not. You are. I'm, no, what I'm You're asking you to do, give me a moment. What I'm asking you to do 
is when you're speaking with someone, we can only be speaking in terms of linguistic definitions. Yes. Not in terms of religious narratives. I'm not interested well, in religious narratives. About, you said to me, you're Bibli forcing a religious no, narrative on me. No, you asked me to speak biblically. No, based on what it says. Not the based Holy on, Spirit I'm going to grab one verse to discern here. the text. So you hold, I ain't got the Holy Spirit. So I know gonna, you ain't, bro. So how am I going to discuss with you then? I'm trying to explain. The, the, You're Quran, basically the Quran, Quran tells you to come to me to ask. Where? Where does it say that? Oh, for where does where does it say go. That? I don't know. Uh, where does it say that? Uh, check with the people of the book. I don't know. Uh -huh. I don't in know. one specific context. In one that, speci oh, so now it does say no, it. One specific context. It Should I tell you what context that is? Go on then, when you've got disputes. The con nope. The context is... People are basically saying, why did God... If you're God confused about no, that, which no, we have revealed, give, me a, give me a moment. When pe people used to say that, why did God send a man as a messenger? Right. And God simply says, go ask the people of the book. Yep. That is who they used to get as a messenger. Right. That's it. Is it, is it that, not, is, you want to be proud of that? No, I know the surah. It doesn't say that. It says, oh, really? and, Bring it up. and if you are confused about that, we, I'm not talking about that then, clearly. Go on, bring if, it any verse you want. If you are confused about that which we have revealed, uh, go ahead. That's the verse. I just told you the context. So you're saying that's prior to what I'm saying? It's specifically to do with a, a, I'm a man you, being a human messenger. I'm asking that's you, it. the ayah that you just mentioned, is that directly before the ayah I just quoted? In you're English. quoting the ayah that I quoted, and you're claiming that you But you're saying prior to that, it's telling you if it's a man or a prophet or something, go and check with him. Because that's not what I heard, what I read. Okay, go ahead, bring it up then. I have to go, but I will. Shoot. But seriously, if you're going to converse with people, you can't say, I've got the Holy Spirit. Then, I can. Then, but I can then there's tell no the way truth. of conversing with you. Of course you. there is. How? It's if I haven't got the Holy Spirit and you've yeah. got the Holy Spirit, the, how can we understand each other? Can I answer you? Yeah. The Holy Spirit comes as an illumination. I'm answering you, though. Yeah, go on. You don't like it, maybe. You don't like speaking about the Holy Spirit. It's in the Quran. I don't know why you wouldn't want to speak about it. What does but the Holy Spirit mean to you? What does it mean to me? All that's ends not, of the but Holy we're Spirit. talking about linguistic definition. Yeah, linguistic. Yeah, yeah, but that's just a strong Holy one. Spirit. What does it mean linguistic? Right. And if you are if you are this... in doubt about that which we have revealed. And then I really have to go. But come next week about that which gosh, how long is this? Right. So, if you are in doubt, O Muhammad, about that which we have revealed to you, then ask those who have been reading the scripture before you. The truth has certainly come to you from you your Lord, so never reading? be among the doubters. 1094. What's the verse before? Surah Yunus. I don't know. It just Get came up like that. Babe, I've got to go. But you do understand how to read stuff. I do understand how context. to read something, yeah. That's the wrong thing. The context is specifically doing with the fact that... But you can't control the narrative as to how I read no, my own I scripture. Even Muhammad does Allah doesn't control, say, really? I'm just pointing something out. Mm. Allah doesn't say to Muhammad, go and tell them. He says, go and ask them. No. He does. No, he I doesn't. just read it to you. You, you read, you so read brackets. Are, you, you know what brackets are, right? Where's the bracket there? Oh, Muhammad is the bracket. Oh, Muhammad is the bracket. Okay, so if you're in doubt about that which was, have revealed to you, we have revealed to you, ask those who have been reading the script. Ask. Don't go and tell them something. Me? Go and ask. Okay. Ask them what, though? I don't know. Exactly. Read the context. I will, but I need to go. I can't read Arabic. You don't need to, they yeah. translate it. 1094, so what, 1093? God even says, if we would have sent angels, yeah. you, would have, uh, you would have not allowed them to walk around in peace. Is that the verse that's talking about you are nothing but a warner? I beg your pardon? You know, when he says, uh, talking about Muhammad, he says, you're nothing but a warner. That if they ask you, where are the signs and the miracles, just refer them back to the Bible, something like that. I don't know what that is. Yeah. But angels did come and walk around. The Bible tells us that. But that's the Bible. Exactly. Revealed by Allah, apparently. Allah never said you read the Bible. The Injil and the Torah and the Psalms. Exactly. Yeah, but it's in the Injil. It's in the, Injur, it's in the Torah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, the New Testament. Yeah. Right. Testament but Paul is recognized by Allah as a true. Yeah. Uh, I, I can't find all the different verses. I, I, take my word for it and I will find yeah, it in the next time. And we had certainly settled the children of Israel. And we had certainly settled the children of Israel in an agreeable settlement 
and provided them with good things and they did not differ until up in brackets after knowledge had come to them so they got the Torah then they started quibbling indeed your Lord will judge between them on the day of resurrection concerning that over which they used to differ and then and if you are in any doubt about that which you have received go and check with them so that's the context yeah the children of Israel was agreeable settlement they were all good where oh, they this, were. Is, this is specifically to do with the fact that this is the same message that has always been sent. Yeah, so Allah oh. did send it then. Yeah. I just said to you about it. No, yeah, but, I don't believe that. Yeah, but there's Bible then there's So it's uh, nothing to do with why did you get a man? I just read the verse. No, this, so you misquoted Okay, no, 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 no. This specific context is specifically due to the fact that, that this message has been sent before. Yeah. That's it. But if you're in doubt, why would you be in doubt? If it's already ex extant in Mecca or Petra or wherever you look, wherever they were, why are you going to be in any doubt? You've got pagans over there. You've got Christians and Jews. Why would you not be in? Why would you not be in, in doubt? I don't you, know. You're you've just been inspired with the message of God. Yeah, but it's but not Muhammad. You day, told me it? the brackets are not to be taken into account. It's talking I'm, to believers I'm, then. Because, because the brackets are specifically put in by the writer. However, if you read the context, it must be to Muhammad. You can understand that whether it, well, it could be Muhammad or it could be the public. But if it's an but Islamic scholar, not, we're going e to go with that. Either, yeah. either or, it's not an issue because the point being. The point being stated here mm -hmm. is that this is a continuous message, they, so therefore there's nothing to be If they would have gone and about. checked with the believers of the previous scripture, they would have most probably been told, unless they were at sword point, that false gospels, false Christs. You know, the Jews say the same thing about you, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. so I don't, don't say take that it so personally. Proudly, I'm not proud. No, but you say that Why as though... Why would I be proud that no, people no, no. are being taken no, to but hell? You say, you say as though... You I say and, it as though you're Jews. appealing no, on, on, on. to the Quran no, that can appeals can to we, the can Bible. We, can we, can we make this a two-way yeah. conversation? Yeah, you're I have speaking, to go. You're speaking as though you and the Jews are on one side. and yeah, the we've got and, the same God. If I may, and the Muslims are quotedly, uh, supposedly plagiarizing. First and foremost, Jews would rather claim that they have the same God as Muslims. No way. Darling, they don't worship man. That's you worship, true. You say three That's in one. Do you want to bring a Jew for you? Yes, Should please. I bring a Jew go for you? Find one. Are you serious? I've got Jews in my family. Listen, go and find one. What do what do Christians and Jews have in common? At least Yahweh. We, at least we have monotheism. Yahweh. So do they say Yahweh is three in one? No, they say Yahweh. They don't do they say, say Allah. Allah is Arabic. I don't give. I don't care. So why are you saying that like it's a name? He's got ninety nine names. Like None no, of them attribute. are Yahweh. All of them are attributes. Why isn't he called Yahweh? Attributes. Why did Muhammad come with a do different you name the for God? Between attributes and a name. Yes, I do. What does Ara what does uh, Muhammad speak? What language does he speak? Arabic, but so not the expect, same Arabic so as you, Arabs today. So do you expect Muhammad to be saying God when he speaks Arabic? Or you, do you, you just told me that Allah may, means if God. I may, if I, yeah, language. Right. But you're using Why didn't he come you're with a using name? It, you're using it like it's a name. Now I've now, got same you now. Thing, now I've same got you thing, from the Quran. Same thing, mate. Give me a second, will you? I've got to go. Same thing. Then don't start an argument then. I'm not starting an argument. You, start, you want to say something and then say, I've got to go. Listen. Then let me speak, then, innit? What did Allah say to Musa? As I was saying, as I was saying, the Jews speak Hebrew, yes. so they're going to refer to the Creator in their language. No, oh, the, no, they're not going to refer to the Creator in their language. I prove you wrong. Moses went to Yahweh. He what? said, "He said." What does Yahweh mean? I am. Listen to me. That's irrelevant. <laughs> he said to him, well, also, "Who it means shall I, I say in what sent me? It means I am in what language? Who shall I say sent me? Uh -huh. My name is the same name in Arabic." Or in what English. does your name mean? It's not about what it means. What? No, it is about what it means. No. Listen, words have meanings. Moses Labels was told do not. the name of God, not the words, attribute, not words. the title. Anyway, this is honestly, so can pathetic. you? Honestly, yeah. This next is week, so next week. No, 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 no. You, Don't say something and then say I gotta go. No, but I've, I said I gotta, I gotta go, go before. After I said my bit. I said, say you that. say your bit. You say have my bit. Then say you gotta go. Wrap up. You can't wrap up. Go on. You. What's your name? K. K. Does it have a meaning? No, that's the definition of a name. Right. Yahweh has a meaning. Yeah. I all am, names have meanings. No, I just don't not necessarily. No, nope, not necessarily. Yeah, no, they don't have to. Show me one. Do names have to have a meaning. They don't have to, but they do. They do. Mean, are cool. All right, cool. But Yahweh has a meaning. Yes. So on what grounds do you say it's a label? So it on means what? the God. And so what, what does Yahweh, Yahweh mean? I am. Uh, so it's says, just a meaning. I am that I am. Christians are dumb, wallahi, man. Just okay, go, so go, go, go. Don't tell me, go. go. Oh, I'm I'm go. Two meters. You can go now, man. Anyway, Bloody hell. You're a that's what you get. Oh, you uh, my spirit. God, man. Yes, your God, not mine. Oh, thank you. You're English. Hebrew is not even your language. Why are you begging it? Okay, are you Arabic? Is Hebrew your are language? Are you Arabic? Oh, do, you, do you hear me saying Allah? 
No. Exactly. Because I can say God, I can say yeah, Ebe. So I'm cool with my. No, but it's just. Oh, don't cool. insult people's you intellect. You. you are. Because. Do you understand? Was told the name of God. Moses is Hebrew. You're yes. English. Stop begging another people's it's culture. There. It's how it's pronounced. It's not, yeah, in it's their not culture. The in their language. No. Yahweh no, is so Hebrew. You Yahweh if I means go to I, Arabia, no, no. my name Hebrew. is still my name. Oh my God. It's not now. Mo he listen. You just Yahweh the right is Hebrew. Yourself, by the way. For, actually, I can give you the Arabic for Yahweh. Go on then. Yahuwah. Oh, do you know why? Why do you call Allah do you know that? What? Moses is in the Quran. No. <laughs> it's Come back from Rome. amazing, bro. Is it? Yeah, yeah. They are common him as well. Hebrew and Arabic. Our cousins. Yes. So if one says Yahweh yep. and the other one and the other one so says why you call, and the other one why says, you call Yeshua and the, Isa? One, and the other one says Yahuwah, uh, it uh, makes uh, sense uh. in their language. Yeah, yeah. But where does your English ask? Where does come Isa from? come from? Where so does Isa come from? Isa. Was it English? Yes. Was it from Manchester? Yes, sir. Is the Arabic? The Arabic is yes. Was it from oh, so, oh, so now you speak it's Arabic? Not Isa. So I have Arabic. Arabic people who I speak to. So now you to. speak Arabic? No. no, but I know some very good Arabic speakers. Unbelievable. Isa is You're not English. Yeshua. Isa. Yeshua. What's it's Yeshua? Not what, religion, in what language? What is it? What is Yeshua it? Yeshua is the Hebrew. Yeshua is the Hebrew. Yeshua is the Arabic. Yeshua is the Arabic. Yes. Is that according to Arabs or is that according to you? It's according to Arabs. Oh really? Yes. Sh show me a single Arab I'll name. Show you the Arab Bible. No, no. I'll Arab show you Bible. Arabic Bible. The Arab Bible. The Arab Bible. 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 That's a question, right? Are you a mad? Question, right? Are you someone with, someone with a narrative. Who wrote the Quran? Someone Quran? with an agenda, Muslim. right? What do you mean agenda? That's his name. Oh my God. Anyway. What? Have you ever met an Arab named Yeshua? Have you ever met an Arab named Yeshua? Are you coming? Have you ever met an Arab named Yeshua? Are you coming? Bloody nuts Christians, man. <laughs> Hebrew is not your language Excellent. and Jesus ain't from London. Get that Who's through your head. You need to chill out. Bro, I never bro, said that. Then stop, stop begging another people's language Who's then. begging on? You are. I could do my Yeshua. life Arabic. Yeah. Yeshua is Hebrew. That's his name. Yeshua is Hebrew. Well, Yahuwah. You want me hold to on, deny hold his Allah name? Allahu la ilaha illa huwa. Hold on. Allahu la ilaha illa huwa al hayyu qayyum. Okay. It's in the Quran too. Excellent. Now what? The Quran is nothing to me. See? So even when I bring the evidence to you, now you ain't got nothing. But that's not Christian the Bible. Both. Okay. And the Bible been written by who? Written by uh, who? Many different people. Many different people. Yeah. And how do you know those people are telling the truth? Uh, because every scripture is God breathed. The Bible oh, says so. so. So you got that many prophets after Jesus. There's no prophets after Jesus. So what makes you think you you're telling the truth? You've got 124,000. So Where's the Chinese the prophet? What Where's the prophet from, from East London? Who's claiming, who's, who's claiming Muslims. specific prophets? Muslims. Who? Okay. Muslims. What they book? They come to the what people book, with their own what language. What book have we claimed? What book have we claimed? The is, the, is the Chinese prophet? I don't know. Or the Korean prophet? Clue. Yeah. So you're lacking You, you can never but be Muhammad's the last prophet. So what? I do it every week. So what, what do you mean, so what? So what? What's the problem with him being the last prophet? Because where's the other 123,999 that Islam claims? Did, did they bring the same message? Does Apparently, Islam claim, they're prophets of Islam, does Islam, yeah. Does Islam claim that they all brought the same message? They should do if they're prophets. Does Islam claim so? They should be from the line of Israel. Answer the question. Does Islam claim? Did God ever say that the, only the line of Israel can have prophets? If they're a prophet of Allah... Did God ever no, say... No, no, let's get back to your only the point. Let's Israel get back to your prophets. point. If they're from Allah, how can they be preaching anything but Islam? Exactly. So if they're so all... So what are you chatting about? I'll tell you what I'm chatting about. If they all brought the same message... But they didn't. They... Where are they? See, you bring one question, she wants to bring in another. But they didn't bring the same message. Let me deal with one they question at a time. Should I deal with a question at a time? No. Should tell I deal me with how a question one man and one woman right. become one tell flesh. Me. Tell and me. Mohammed says four women and one Christians, man. Christians, I've got to go. I've Christians, I've genuinely bro. got to go. Yeah, I'm just... Christians. Yeah, that's right. Do you want me to deal with one question at a time or not? No. Or do you want to go like a Christian? I honestly Holy have Spirit. to come back. Holy Spirit. I just said no. Is Holy Spirit. Same Holy Spirit. That's in the Quran you mean. Are you going to let me speak? Are you blaspheming? Are you going to let me speak? But are you blaspheming? I'm a blaspheming. Are you blaspheming the Spirit? I'm a blaspheming. Because I'm forgivable. I'm no, just it's saying. No, you speak about Holy Spirit. No. You say Holy Spirit comes and just makes you into some sort of a magician. Not particularly. I didn't say that at all. So then, then, then do you know how to convert? I make do, one but claim, not with someone who clearly needs claim, to chill. I'm trying to chill, but if you keep well, speaking over me, you keep speaking over me. Excellent. And you won't let me go after you said something. Yahuwah ain't English. Exactly. And Jesus ain't from London. Get that through your head. Yeah, it's a bit of a confusion. What the hell, bro?